Want to make your CS2 buttery smooth and boost your FPS? In this video, I'll show you some simple yet powerful settings that will give you massive FPS gains and eliminate lag in Counter-Strike 2. Stick around till the end so you don't miss any crucial tweaks. If you find this helpful, hit that like button and make sure to subscribe. Let's dive in. The Gear Up Booster application is a powerful tool designed to help you achieve zero ping and maximum FPS. Download the application for free using the provided link in the description. Select the CS2 game and click the Boost button. This will initiate the network optimization process, selecting the best routing settings for you automatically. Download it now. Start by searching for Registry Editor and run it as Administrator. Once inside, copy the exact path from the video description and paste it here then hit Enter. Now, let's start tweaking. Locate Affinity, change its value to F, and set the base to hexadecimal. Next, find background only and set it to false. Then, adjust GPU priority. Set its value to E and base it to hexadecimal. For priority, set the value to six. Finally, change both scheduling category and FSIO priority to high, confirming each change. Now, open the Windows search bar and type delivery. From the search results, click on allow downloads from other PCs. This feature lets your system share update files with other devices, which can drain system resources. To boost performance, toggle. This setting off so your PC isn't acting as an update source. Next, search for focus in the search bar and select focus assist. This feature controls when notifications pop up. For uninterrupted gaming, set it to activate during full screen apps or gaming sessions. Choose alarms only to limit notifications to just critical alerts. This will help keep distractions to a minimum. Now, search for adjust in the search bar and click on adjust the appearance and performance of windows. Switch to the custom option. Check show thumbnails instead of icons and smooth edges of screen fonts, then click apply to save. Go to the advanced tab and under processor scheduling, select programs to prioritize your active apps like games over background services for better performance. Search for mouse settings in the Windows search bar and open it. Scroll down, click on additional mouse options and go to the pointer options tab. Uncheck enhanced pointer precision to disable it for more accurate and consistent mouse movement during gameplay. Hit OK to apply. As an optional step, type core isolation in the search bar and open it under Windows security. This feature improves system protection, but can use extra CPU power. Test the performance with it enabled, then disable it and compare in a game like Counter-Strike 2. If you notice smoother gameplay with it off, you can decide based on your needs. Just keep in mind that disabling it lowers security a bit, so weigh the performance gain carefully. Next, search for game mode in the Windows search bar and make sure it's turned on. Enabling this will prioritize gaming by minimizing background tasks. Now go to graphics settings and turn on hardware accelerated GPU scheduling. This reduces latency and boosts performance. Under graphics performance preference, set it to desktop, app, then click browse. Navigate to your CS2 installation folder and select the CS2.exe file. Once added, click options, choose high performance and click save. This will force your system to use the best performance settings for CS2. The Gear Up Booster application is a powerful tool designed to help you achieve zero ping and maximum FPS. Download the application for free using the provided link in the description. Select the CS2 game and click the Boost button. This will initiate the network optimization process, selecting the best routing settings for you automatically. Download it now. Press Windows. Force X Open Device Manager and Expand Network Adapters. Right-click your network device, go to Properties, and under the Advanced tab, disable TCP Checksum Offload and Large Send Offload. This helps reduce latency in CS2. Next, expand system devices, locate high precision event timer, right click and choose disable. This tweak can improve FPS for many systems. If you notice any issues, simply re-enable it, but most users see smoother gameplay with it turned off. All right, let's move on to the advanced video settings in Counter-Strike 2 to improve visibility, reduce input lag and maximize FPS especially on low-end PCs. These settings are crucial for a smoother experience and faster reactions in intense situations. Start by enabling boost player contrast. This makes enemies pop out more, 
especially in dark or crowded maps. Then, turn off vertical sync to eliminate delay between your mouse movements and the screen's response, giving you quicker aiming and reactions. Next, set NVIDIA Reflex Low Latency to Enabled, not Plus Boost. While the Plus Boost option can AWI, further reduce latency, it can put too much strain on your GPU, especially on lower-end systems. Enabled gives you smoother input without overburdening your GPU. Disable Multi-Sampling Anti-Aliasing Mode. It smooths edges but reduces FPS significantly, especially on low-spec systems. Turning it off will boost your performance without much visual sacrifice. Let's adjust shadow and texture settings to improve performance. Set global shadow quality to very low and turn off dynamic shadows. This reduces GPU load while maintaining. Clear gameplay. Set model texture detail to low for a solid FPS boost and choose bilinear for texture filtering mode to keep textures sharp but lighter on the GPU. Set shader detail and shadow detail to low or very low to minimize processing demands. Reduce particle detail to very low to cut down on effects like smoke or flashbangs that can drop FPS. Turn off ambient occlusion to remove soft lighting effects and further improve FPS. For high dynamic range, choose performance over quality. While HDR enhances lighting and colors, it's a major performance hit. Opting for performance will improve FPS, especially on lower end graphics cards, without sacrificing too much on visuals. With these settings, your low-end PC will run CS2, much smoother, giving you consistent FPS, sharper aiming, and better overall performance, no matter how demanding the match is. So guys, that's it for today's video. Hit the like button, make sure to subscribe, and feel free to ask any questions in the comments below. Peace out.